12.40 this afternoon, uh, Oakland Fire Department got a report of a reported structure fire on uh, Warfield Avenue. Uh, we dispatched four engines and two trucks to the reported structure fire. While en route, the truck behind me uh, was responding to a reported structure fire uh, when they were involved in a motor vehicle collision where they collided with a building. Uh, there was no civilian damages. However, we have three firefighters that were injured in the accident and uh, they were be currently being treated at a Highland Hospital for moderate injuries. At this time, we don't know if there's any life-threatening injuries, but it's moderate injuries. We are asking the public if anybody has any video footage of this because this is an active investigation. OPD is investigating this motor vehicle accident. If anybody has any um, video image or still photo images of it, uh, please uh, send those forward. We're doing an active investigation on determining the cause. They were traveling on Grand Avenue, responding code three, which is lights and sirens to reported structure fire. Five total firefighters were on the truck with three firefighters having injuries. All firefighters on the truck, all five of them were evaluated and three of them were treated and transported to Highland Hospital. This truck is located at 4455 27th Street at station number 15. So we have a city of Oakland building engineer en route to evaluate the structural stability of the building at this time so we can determine what needs to be done if the building needs to be shored and then we'll go ahead and, uh, once the investigation is complete then we'll remove the vehicle but we're not going to move, move the vehicle until all documentation pictures have been taken of the vehicle so we did make contact with the business owner of the business and we're working with her as well as the occupants that uh, live above the bill uh, above the business so we're working with red cross to ensure that we have everyone that may be displaced that they're being taken care of as well so there's now, a total of 21 units in this building and we have a complete gas and electric shut off to the building so all people are displaced at this time and red cross is working with all of them the firefighter who was driving the apparatus is one of the injured firefighters